Luther, we know you're back there. You don't need to run anymore. Call me on that number. Let's talk. It's going to be okay, Luther. I'm here to help you. If heaven was a mile away and you could ride by the gates, would you try to run inside when it opens? Would you try to die today? Would you pray loud and finally believe in his power? Even if you could see, but you could feel, but you still doubt. It wasn't supposed to be this way, man. I was supposed to make something special. I know, but Daddy, listen to me. I don't know what's on the other side of this door. What's going on? What's going on? Tell me what's just, going on. Just tell him I love him. Tell him I love him and that I'm sorry. What did you do? What's happening? Danny. Danny, listen, bro. This wasn't him. Man. Come out with your hands up. I know. I'm sorry. You're not a lover. You're not a lover. Call me, please. Man, just tell me what's just tell me what's going on. Danny, what's going on? What's going on? Wait, 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 Luther. Man, Luther. To my mom, look at me, baby. I love you, girl. Your boy is shining. God's son, son, son. I always knew I wouldn't make a difference. I only cared about making millions. What you hear in this po- Bro, why'd you stop, man? You out of pocket, bro. Are you serious? I was right on it. Nah. What you mean, nah, Danny? Sounded good to me. Let's just try it again. Man, nah, man. You cutting in on my flow. Let's, let's go. Let's go. Let's go talk, Danny. I'll talk to him. One sec. Yo. Yo, what are you doing? We on the clock here, man. Listen, I know this dude is whack, but he knows- Danny, are you- Stop, stop. Are you listening to yourself, bro? How many times have we said this dude is whack, or this dude is lazy, or this dude is drunk? How many times have we worked with some random producer then brush it off as if it's nothing, bro? I'm tired of doing it this way, man. Listen, he whack, but he cheap. Exactly, bro. He's cheap. We ain't gonna get to where we want to be with cheap. You hear me? This ain't it, bro. Okay, so let's let's finish out today no, and we'll find no, someone else. No, 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 no. No. That no. I, I got a better way. We gonna do it ourselves. What are you saying, man? What I'm saying is we're gonna buy our own studio and we're gonna do this our way, because I'm done buying all these fake dreams people are selling. But you got a, you got some inheritance I don't know about Luther. Who paying for that? You? Yeah. <laughs> How?
going at 7 a.m. in the morning? Mom, you scared me. Where are you going? I gotta... I gotta go. I gotta go into the studio. You never go this early. What's been going on with you lately? Nothing. Uh, I'm good. I'm good. I gotta go. Luther, come here. Come here, please. Hey. You hurt me? Good. Good. Um, I gotta go. going Talk about all that. I, I, mean, I, well, I did hear about the news, and it's not. Uh, anyway, it's, it's not important. Oh, yeah. You don't recognize me, do you? Oh. oh man, I figured. It's been about ten years. It's Gabriel. Nicky Scott, brother. Oh, Gabriel. <laughs> That's you. Mm -hmm. I mean, you you look uh... different. <laughs> yeah. Drugs will do that to you. I mean, it might be the rugged job that throw you off too. Oh, I didn't even recognize you. What you, what you doing in here? I, mean, I knew you was pushing, but I know, I know, I know, I know, man. But man, it's good to see you, bro. Listen, let's catch up later. There's something I won't give you. What you mean, man? Come on. I, I mean, if you follow me, I can show you. Don't worry about it, it ain't even like that. Trust me. Come on. Guys, this is Luther. We actually grew up together, but I hadn't seen him in quite some time. He just went through a hellish experience potentially facing a life sentence. Now, Luther, we're guessing you feel a little defeated right now. But well, we want to pray for you, brother. Oh, no, 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 no I'm, I'm good, man. God didn't want nothing to do with me. I appreciate that. I'm, I'm good. And he wants everything to do no, with you. No, no, we, we ain't on good terms. So I'm, I'm good, but I, I'm gonna go back. No, no, no. Hey, Luther, Luther, Luther. Listen, brother, I've been in and out of prison for years. You know, thinking I could change by tightening up my bootstraps and doing good deeds to make up for my wrongdoings. But it didn't work. It got worse. I got into drugs, selling drugs, just, just doing stupid stuff. Ultimately, I'd end up right back here. Man, I was in my final world the last time I was here, facing 10 years without my family. But guess what? Guess what? God met me behind bars. He met me in the depths. 
He met me with grace when I deserved justice. He had someone tap me on the shoulder, just like I did with you. That tap was grace, Luther. Man, I did everything I could to ruin my life, but he still had a plan for me. Now, ain't that beautiful? That's beautiful. Yes, yeah, yeah, sir. Yeah. <laughs> beautiful. And guess what? Yeah, you do the same for you, Luther. Yeah. Where the Spirit of the Lord is, there is freedom. 2 Corinthians 3.17. He's not confined to a church or a pulpit. We are the church. He's here. He's here, even behind bars, Luther. Psalms 139.8 says, If I go up to the heavens, you are there. If I make my bed in the depths, you are there. He'll meet you where you're at. Yeah. I've been running from him for so long. He's been chasing me, I just ain't let him. I did the same thing for years. But I need you to understand one thing. God isn't chasing after you with judgment, bro. He's chasing after you with mercy and grace. He just wants a relationship with his son. When are you gonna stop running? I tried everything else. Yeah, it didn't work out, did it? I'm facing life. My life's over. No, 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 no. Hey, God is the ultimate judge. All right? He can provide you with freedom. He has a final say over your life, not the justice system. You hear me? He has a final word over your life. Not these bars. I promise you. Yeah. 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 You done running? I think so. Yeah, I'm done. I'm done. <laughs> Sit down. Thanks. Uh, what you reading? Book of John, chapter three. Hmm. Which verse? Seventeen. For God did not send His Son into this world to condemn this world, but to save the world through Him. Love that. One. How you know all this, man? <laughs> well, I've had a lot of time. And love listening. Hmm. You want to show me your favorite verse? <laughs> well, I don't know how to read or write, Luther. Oh, really? Yeah, man, it's all in here. My bad, man. I'm sorry. I didn't. I didn't know it. Nah, it's all good, man. It's not something I really broadcasted growing up. Well, maybe one day I'll be able to read or write. In the meantime, I just listen. You know, when the when the world gets noisy and the lies stack up, I just tune into his voice. Kind of like this, let me show you. It's like putting on God's headphones. <laughs> Isaiah 61.1, that's my favorite verse. Why don't you read it for me? It's towards the back. Yeah. And the Spirit of the Lord is on me because the Lord has anointed me to preach the good news to the poor. He sent me to bind up the brokenhearted, to proclaim liberty for the captives and release from darkness for the prisoners. Well, what do you think this means? Well, freedom is a mindset, Luther. I'm more free in here than I ever was out there. You know, there's people that get to go home to their families with a nice meal, like some of these nice guards here. You know, they got a nice car, nice house, nice 401k. But they still in prison inside. 
I'm free. Hey, yeah, yeah. And that's all that matters. Mm -hmm. Liberty to the captives. Yeah, that is right. Speaking of, you get out on bond tomorrow, right? Yeah. Yeah, I uh, got some time before my trial. I get to go spend it with my family. Man, that's a miracle. Man, most people don't get out from what you did. I know. God is good. Yes, he is. Hey, no matter what happens with your trial, just remember you're already free, brother. Hey, Amen. Amen. You want your Bible back? Did you forget the whole I can't read thing? <laughs> That's for you. It's a gift from us guys. Thank you, Gabe. I appreciate that, man, truly. Of course. Yeah, thank you. Hey. Hold on to his word. It'll be what sustains you in or out of prison. Jesus is the best thing that ever happened to us. That's the reason why we sing. Come on, praise team. Someone asked the question. Why? Why do we sing? When we lift. When we lift our hands to Jesus. What do that really mean? What do we really mean? You know something, you may be, you may be wondering. Someone may be wondering. When we sing our song. At times we may be crying. At times we may be crying. And nothing is even wrong. And nothing's even wrong. Here it is, I sing because. I sing because. Lord, we thank you for your grace. Lord, we thank you for your mercy. Lord, we thank you for a Luther, Lord. We are praying for reduced sentence, Lord. We are praying for what looks like a miracle to the world, Lord. But as a son of yours, Lord, this is your power and your glory, Lord. May it be evident now, Lord. Come, Lord. We pray in the mighty name of Jesus, Lord, for this miracle of miracles. Amen. Glory, hallelujah! Glory, hallelujah! I sing these praises to you. I sing these praises to you. Glory, hallelujah! Glory, hallelujah! That's the reason why. That's the reason why I sing. Come on. Oh, Due to the severity of these crimes and the multiple charges, including armed carjacking, display of a weapon during the felony, armed kidnapping, and burglary of an occupied conveyance, I have no choice but to sentence Luther Cauley to 25 years in prison. Shepherd dog, but you can call me Pastor Luther. Shepherd dog? Like a border collie. Got it. Devin. Devin. Nice to meet you, man. Listen, I don't know what you did to get in here, but this ain't the end for you. What you mean? Can I tell you about the way to true freedom?
Good afternoon. The longer you run from God or run towards things that have absolutely nothing to do with God, the more painful your experience is going to be. And that's the, I think, the biggest point of reference I can give to individuals about my story, that God had a better plan all along. He didn't want my life to just be a vain life where I just direct all the attention to me. Yeah, look at me, I can rhyme, or look at me, I'm a star, or I'm a celebrity. He said, I'll give you notoriety once I trust you with obscurity. And he hid me for 20 years under lock and key in the Department of Correction. He hid me, but he allowed me to germinate like a seed, impact to show me that my greatness is far beyond worldly success. I want to use you to direct people to me. The truth is... When I say free in my faith, free, free, free in my faith. All the people say, see, I just don't want you to be happy. But then you gotta have something happen. I want you to have joy, cause can't nobody take that from you. <laughs> I see you smiling. <laughs>